Hello and welcome to my Yeezy 350 Parrot Black review. This has been sent by Jesse. I will be discussing and reviewing the quality of the shoe and how 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 it comes close to the real Yeezys. Uh, I will also put the, the link in the description for the shoes, the link to buy and also Jesse's WhatsApp number so you can contact him and ask any questions. To start with, the quality of the box is brilliant. There is actually no damage on the box. It's a double box from China to the UK and the quality is great. So that is really good. As you open the box, you will find obviously the paper and inside the paper, Jesse provides obviously the shoes, which I'll put aside for now. But you, al you also get a pair of Yeezy socks, which are actually really nice. I can use those in the winter, which is always the case in the UK. And you also get the receipt with the shoe. Double sided as well, so it looks more real. Now we'll review the shoes. So this is the Pride Black, size nine and a half. I have tried to get the best lighting I can possibly get. And yep, so these are the shoes. I will start now. Of course, I will start with the laces at first. They are the correct type of lace. You can find some that will just come plain black, but this is the correct pattern and contrast with the shoes. The tips are also black, which have come with this with the shoes, which is good. There is no white tip, which is an issue with the replicas. The pattern has, if you can see here, right over here, the eight pattern, the two eye pattern, the same over here. And also for this one, you'll see the eight over here, and you also see it around here on this shoe. So the pattern is all correct. Also, the stitching does curve a bit, which is perfect. Yeezys are meant to have a curve stitching. There are many out there which do not have a, a curve stitching. This has a curve stitching, it is correct. Same with this shoe. And this is because the pattern follows the curve. The Yeezy pattern is not 100% straight. This is perfect because you can also see that the pattern follows to the heel tab. It does not go straight or it does not go down, it curves up. Same for this shoe over here. The heel tab is correct as you have here. You have one, two, three, four, five, and this one outside, six. And then for this one, one, two, three, four, five, six. You can pause the video and count these. And you can also count this. Also, Jesse has done a fantastic job at leaving uh, the correct space between the, sh the heel tab and the sock liner. It is close enough, it isn't too close, because there are many replicas where they, they decide to put it really high up where there's no gap, and there are some that start too low down. So this is perfect heel tap space. I will now go through the suede patches. Jesse has done a very good job at it, stamping on the, embroid the, 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 the patches, the Adidas patch and also the YZY on the other shoe. It is a green, green suede, you cannot see it perfectly in the lighting, but it is a green suede which does change color, which is good. It's a good quality suede, and also uh, the sizing is correct, and the Adidas imprint, the trefoil imprint, is perfect. It is big, it is not small like replicas as you can find, it is actually a very good suede. It's actually perfect. I will now look at the YZY one, which I'll bring over here now. And this one's slightly harder to see because of the lighting. Here we are, as you can see, green suede, YZY is big enough, bold enough to see, and the suede color is all correct, 10 out of 10. Underneath the shoe, this is the sole. The boost is very, very squishy, so it, it is obviously a real boost, it's not a trick there, it's real boost, as you can see, my, my fingers are going through it very nicely, very comfortable, again, I've tried these shoes in, indoors, and you can see a bit of dust here, because I've tried them and they are very comfortable they they do fit half size down so i usually am a size 10 with normal shoes adidas shoes but i get nine and a half in these and they are snug good fit which i recommend for these yeezys 
the other right card nipples one two three four five six seven the adidas logo and yeah it's all correct over here and you can again pause the video and count the nipples here again one two three four five six seven it's hard to see with the lighting i'm sorry for that but as you can see the quality of the shoe is very good another thing i noticed i never talk about this unless it is really good the glue drop of Jesse's shoes are fantastic. There is no residue of glue around the shoe. As you can see, there is no residue. The same applies for the other shoe over here. I will now just look into the shoe for you. So as you can see, this is the sizing sticker on the side of the shoe and the same is for this one, the opposite side. Uh, the printing on the sole, the insole is correct correct color and it does look like it's durable as I can rub it and it's hard to see right now the lighting so I will actually zoom out a bit but it does seem very really correct I will now grab out the insoles so you can see the the inner sole so this is the insole and as you can see this is actually one of the best insoles I have seen for replica it is not too bumpy and fat it is actually correct sharp adidas trefoil sign and the same applies for this one i have checked for the for the time sake of the video i will not pop that one out because the timing will get too long for review and for this you can it's hard to see but it's all correct in here there's more support as well at the back as you can see cushion which is very nice very comfortable shoe this is focus yep over here so all of that is very correct actually inside the shoe the insole the pattern the laces everything is spot on so to conclude jesse's shoes these real boost easy 350 pirate blacks are definitely a 10 out of 10 the quality is very good the comfort is perfect the cushioning around the back around the heel is all very nice the boost is real so whenever you're walking you will feel comfort the lacing is correct the stitching is correct on the front the pattern goes the correct way and again one of the biggest issues with shoes that i find with the replicas are the suede patches but he has done a perfect job with the imprint of the logos on the suede patch which is a really high quality the hill tab is also perfect so you don't have to worry about the hill tab so 10 out of 10 shoe brilliant service from jesse he will communicate with you over whatsapp very quickly I would recommend talking to him, checking out his other shoes. He has V2, 750. He also has Adidas NMDs on his website. So you can check out all his shoes. There is a, a, a link in the, below in the description where you can check out everything. And thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed my review. And please let me know what you'd like me to review next. Thank you very much and have a nice day.